NASA has discovered a super Earth that could have conditions to sustain life. The new exoplanet is 137 light years away, or about roughly 800 trillion miles. Astronomers say the planet is about one and a half times the size of Earth and orbits a small reddish star that is cooler than our sun. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has hardly opened its eyes, and the universe is new. More mysterious, more beautiful than humanity's dreams. Quite exciting. I mean, we haven't found an exact twin for the Earth. This isn't an exact replica, but out of this latest haul of 500 new possible planets, a bit bigger than the Earth, about 50% bigger, but it's... This is a huge discovery, and we think that it's a huge discovery. That's the most exciting piece of this, of this telescope, of this remarkable instrument we've put in space is finding things that we didn't expect, that we can't explain, because that means that we have to revise our understanding of the universe. Well, JWST is so phenomenal that if you spend enough time, you could probably find any galaxy that ever formed uh, in the universe. It's really that powerful. The James Webb Space Telescope gave us the clearest picture ever of Proxima b, sparking excitement and curiosity. This amazing image shows us what one of the closest Earth-like planets looks like in great detail. But what secrets does this far-off world hide? Could there be life there? What can this new, super-clear image teach us about space mysteries we haven't solved yet? Tune in as we dive deeper into these discoveries and maybe learn more about our universe. Exploring the extremes. Understanding the formation of galaxies requires us to peer back across eons, navigating through the vast expanse of the universe's history, which stretches across billions of years. In this pursuit, the James Webb Space Telescope is an invaluable asset, enhancing our ability to observe the cosmos at unprecedented distances. The telescope employs infrared technology to capture images, producing visuals that are unlike anything previously available. But just when we thought we had seen the universe's secrets, a new discovery appeared, one that changes everything we thought we knew about how the universe began. What if the first galaxies aren't where we thought they would be? This capability is akin to applying a sophisticated photo filter on a smartphone, which significantly enhances the quality of the images. The advanced technological tools of the telescope allow scientists to explore the depths of space with extraordinary clarity and detail, providing insights into the cosmic phenomena that shape our understanding of the universe. Astronomers employ the James Webb Space Telescope to deepen their understanding of seminal cosmic events such as the Big Bang and to unravel the complex processes of star and planet formation. Furthermore, they investigate the atmospheres of exoplanets outside our solar system to assess their potential to harbor life. Equipped with specialized cameras and filters, the telescope can isolate and analyze specific wavelengths of light. This capability enables scientists to probe the visual data collected, offering insights and potentially answering some of the most profound mysteries of the universe. The extraordinary reach of the James Webb Space Telescope, both in terms of space and time, surpasses any previous astronomical tool, facilitating groundbreaking discoveries. For instance, observations made with the telescope have led astronomers to revise their understanding of the mass of certain gigantic galaxies, finding them to be more substantial than previously estimated. A landmark achievement was the telescope's capture of the first-ever ultra-clear image of Proxima b, marking a significant milestone in space exploration. This discovery was built upon earlier observations made in 2013, when scientists detected a subtle gravitational influence exerted by Proxima b on its star, prompting further investigation. This research highlights the harsh conditions of Proxima b. Its dark side, always turned away from its star, is extremely cold, possibly freezing water. Orbiting Proxima Centauri, the closest star system after the Sun, Proxima b lets us see the Alpha Centauri system as it was four years ago, 
This perspective not only deepens our knowledge of Proxima b, but also the dynamics of nearby star systems. Proxima b, only 25 light-years from the Sun, is among the most Earth-like exoplanets found. Despite this, it's very different from Earth. For example, a year on Proxima b lasts just 11.2 days, and the planet is about 30% larger than Earth, adding to its distinctiveness. Moreover, Proxima b's proximity to its host star, Proxima Centauri, is remarkably close, only 7.3 million kilometers away. This distance is less than 5% of the vast expanse that separates Earth from the Sun, contributing to a variety of extreme conditions on the planet. Proxima Centauri itself is a red dwarf star, considerably smaller and cooler than our Sun, and emits far less energy. From the surface of Proxima b, Proxima Centauri would appear as a colossal, red sphere in the sky, three times larger in apparent size than our Sun viewed from Earth, albeit much dimmer. This star's positioning within the so-called habitable zone might allow for the presence of liquid water on Proxima b, but this does not imply Earth-like conditions. Envision gearing up for an expedition to Proxima b, a world that challenges our notions of habitability. It's important to note that Proxima b could be tidally locked with its star. This means that one hemisphere perpetually basks in daylight, while the opposite side remains shrouded in unending night. The implications for potential life forms are severe. The sunlit side might experience scorching temperatures high enough to boil off any surface water, while the dark side could become so cold that any atmospheric moisture would likely freeze. This dichotomy creates a planet of stark contrasts and extreme environments, posing significant challenges for any form of life that might exist there, as well as for human explorers contemplating a visit. The unique and harsh conditions of Proxima b make it a fascinating subject of study, yet they also highlight the resilience required for survival on such a world. Embarking on a journey to Proxima Centauri presents a formidable challenge, not least because of the peculiar characteristics of the star itself. Proxima Centauri is a diminutive yet exceedingly active star, with nuclear reactions occurring close to its surface, contributing to its overall instability. This proximity of nuclear activity to the star's surface results in unpredictable and intense behaviors that significantly impact its surrounding environment. Planets like Proxima b, which orbit within the star's habitable zone, are particularly vulnerable to these adverse effects. The powerful magnetic fields of Proxima Centauri generate extreme conditions, including intense radiation and storms of high-energy particles. These phenomena pose severe obstacles to the development and sustainability of life as we understand it, creating an environment that is, at best, inhospitable solar flares and life's fragility. Among the most significant threats to any budding life forms on Proxima b are the frequent and intense solar flares emitted by Proxima Centauri. These solar flares have the potential to be devastating, with the capacity to obliterate nascent biological developments in their wake. Research indicates that Proxima b receives approximately 1,000 times more solar wind radiation than Earth, exposing the planet to harsh cosmic weather that would challenge the resilience of any form of life. In a striking example of this star's volatility, in April 2021, Proxima Centauri unleashed the most potent solar flare ever recorded, which was a hundred times more powerful than the strongest flares observed from our own Sun. Despite the extreme and often hostile conditions surrounding Proxima Centauri, the fascination with discovering a potentially habitable planet in this star system remains undiminished. This interest was further fueled by an intriguing development in late 2020 when scientists picked up an unusual signal emanating from the Alpha Centauri system. The signal, detected at a frequency of 982.07 MHz, was not associated with any known Earth-based satellites, 
leading to intense speculation and excitement about the potential presence of intelligent life in the vicinity. The allure of uncovering otherworldly intelligence, coupled with the natural human drive to explore the unknown, continues to propel scientific inquiry and imagination regarding Proxima Centauri and its planets. The dream of visiting Proxima Centauri and potentially discovering alien life feels a bit more achievable today, thanks to new technologies and ideas being explored. This long-held vision, once limited to the realm of science fiction, is now edging closer to reality as scientific projects take on the enormous challenge of interstellar travel. One such initiative is the Breakthrough Initiatives, a groundbreaking effort that aims to dramatically cut down the travel time to Proxima Centauri. Instead of the many centuries it would currently take to reach the nearest star system, these efforts aim to reduce the journey to mere decades. While this still sounds far off, it marks a huge step forward in our ability to explore the cosmos. To achieve this ambitious goal, scientists are delving into exciting concepts like propelling spacecraft at nearly the speed of light. This would mean harnessing revolutionary new technology to push the boundaries of what we thought was possible. One idea involves utilizing the power of light itself to move spacecraft. By using powerful lasers to send small, lightweight probes hurtling through space at incredible speeds, we could make interstellar travel more feasible. The technology being explored has the potential to move us far beyond what traditional rocket engines can achieve. However, even with these advanced ideas, interstellar travel is still incredibly difficult. If we were to rely on today's technology, a trip to Proxima Centauri would take about 6,000 years, an unthinkably long time for any human mission. As space exploration advances, new projects and innovations are constantly being developed. One of the most exciting of these is the Starshot Initiative, which is specifically focused on overcoming the vast distances between stars. Starshot is exploring the potential of using extremely powerful lasers to propel small, high-speed spacecraft toward Alpha Centauri, the star system that contains Proxima Centauri. These spacecraft, though tiny, could gather vital information about distant planets, helping us better understand the possibilities for life beyond our solar system. This approach could significantly speed up space travel. By directing intense laser beams at spacecraft with reflective sails, these ships could accelerate to near-light speeds, potentially reaching Alpha Centauri in just 20 to 30 years. Although these missions would be unmanned, they would greatly advance our knowledge of the universe. Adaptive optics play a crucial role in these projects by correcting distortions caused by Earth's atmosphere, which affects both spaceflight and propulsion lasers. These technologies ensure that lasers remain focused and effective during space travel. Despite the challenges, advancements in laser propulsion, adaptive optics, and spacecraft design are promising. Interstellar travel is evolving from a distant dream into a feasible venture, potentially allowing us to reach Proxima Centauri much sooner than expected. What once seemed like fantasy is now within reach, potentially revolutionizing our exploration of the stars. Even with all the advancements, many technical, logistical, and financial hurdles must be addressed. However, the determination to push forward, fueled by the human desire to explore the unknown, shows that these challenges won't stop us from dreaming of reaching the stars. The question now is not if we will one day travel to Proxima Centauri, but when? The ambitious plan is for the spacecraft to reach Alpha Centauri in as little as 22 years, propelled by the power of lasers. These lasers would generate an astonishing 100 gigawatts of energy, which is about the same as the total amount of electricity used by the entire United States at any given time. This impressive energy output is necessary to accelerate the spacecraft to a significant fraction of the speed of light, 
allowing it to cover the enormous distance between Earth and Alpha Centauri in just over two decades. However, despite the promise of this plan, there are still many challenges to overcome. Navigating through the vast emptiness of interstellar space may sound straightforward, but in reality, the spacecraft would need to dodge interstellar debris, tiny particles that could severely damage the spacecraft traveling at such high speeds. Even if the spacecraft manages to avoid these obstacles and successfully reaches Alpha Centauri, there's still the issue of communicating back with Earth. The distance between our planet and Alpha Centauri is so immense that any signals sent from the spacecraft would take four years to reach Earth. This means that even after the probe arrives, it will take another four years before we know whether it succeeded in its mission or what data it was able to collect. Managing this delay in communication adds another layer of complexity to an already challenging mission. Unlocking the stars. Once the initial launch system is successfully developed and tested, it could open the door to a future where space missions become significantly more cost-effective. The high costs and challenges associated with interstellar exploration have long been a limiting factor, but with breakthroughs like laser propulsion systems, launching additional spacecraft to explore distant stars could become much more affordable. One of the most exciting possibilities is that these advanced probes wouldn't have to be limited to a single target. While Alpha Centauri, as the nearest star system, is the most obvious first goal, other systems, such as Proxima Centauri and even further ones, could soon be within our reach. Each new mission could provide us with invaluable insights into the planets that orbit these distant stars, particularly exoplanets, which are planets located outside our solar system. By sending multiple probes, we can gather a wider range of data, giving us a clearer picture of what these exoplanets are like. And the more we explore, the more likely we are to discover new worlds that may be capable of supporting life, which remains one of the most profound questions in science today. Exploring exoplanets is a crucial part of these missions because of what they represent the possibility of discovering life beyond Earth. Exoplanets have captured the imagination of scientists and the public alike, as they offer us the chance to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? Many of these exoplanets have been found within the habitable zone of their parent stars. This region is sometimes called the Goldilocks zone because it is not too hot and not too cold, but just the right temperature for liquid water to exist. Since water is a fundamental requirement for life as we know it, the presence of water on an exoplanet raises the possibility that life could potentially exist there. The study of exoplanets has come a long way since the first confirmed discovery of planets outside our solar system in 1992. These early discoveries were of planets orbiting neutron stars, an environment very different from our own. But as technology has improved, scientists have identified thousands of exoplanets, and many of these planets are not only similar in size to Earth but also lie within their star's habitable zone. These Earth-like exoplanets are particularly exciting because they may have conditions that could support life, either in the form of microorganisms or perhaps even more complex life forms. Every new discovery brings us closer to answering whether life exists elsewhere in the universe. Studying distant exoplanets can greatly enhance our understanding of planetary formation and diversity. By examining how these planets develop and change, we learn about our own solar system's origins. Comparing the atmospheres of exoplanets with those of Earth, Venus, or Mars helps us understand how planetary environments evolve. This insight can also predict Earth's future environment and the factors that influence a planet's ability to support life. Moreover, research on exoplanets addresses fundamental questions. What conditions allow for life? How common are Earth-like planets? Might some planets be even more hospitable than Earth? As we deploy more probes and analyze more data, 
will better understand our place in the universe. In the future, with a well-established laser propulsion system, we could imagine a fleet of small, fast-moving probes exploring a variety of star systems. Each one would be tasked with gathering data, analyzing the atmospheres of distant exoplanets, and searching for signs of water or other conditions necessary for life. The probes could send back information about the chemical composition of these planets, the temperatures on their surfaces, and whether they have moons or magnetic fields, all of which are important factors in determining whether life could survive there. And it's not just about finding life. Exploring exoplanets also allows us to better understand the diversity of planetary systems. Some exoplanets may have environments that are incredibly different from anything we've seen before. Gas giants with massive storms, frozen worlds covered in ice, or planets with extreme volcanic activity. Each of these discoveries expands our knowledge of the universe and helps us understand how planets work on a fundamental level. Sending more probes to distant exoplanets helps us solve universe mysteries faster. As we explore and discover various planets, including those in habitable zones like the Goldilocks zone, our understanding of the cosmos and the potential for life evolves. Advances like laser propulsion now make these missions more achievable, suggesting that answers to some of our greatest cosmic questions may be within reach. Since their discovery in the early 90s, exoplanets have dramatically reshaped our view of the universe. Previously thought to be speculative, we now know these planets are widespread, with many resembling Earth and capable of supporting life. This realization has spurred intense interest in these distant worlds, especially those with conditions conducive to liquid water, a crucial component for life. But even beyond the search for life, the study of exoplanets provides valuable insights into the formation and evolution of planetary systems. By studying these distant worlds, scientists can learn more about how planets form, how they interact with their stars, and how their atmospheres develop. This knowledge, in turn, helps us understand more about our own solar system and the history of planets like Earth. Moreover, the discovery of so many Earth-like exoplanets raises questions about the uniqueness of our planet. Are we truly alone in the universe, or could there be other planets that support intelligent life? Missions like the one aimed at Alpha Centauri could bring us closer to answering this question. As technology advances and we continue to send probes to distant star systems, our ability to explore these far-off worlds will only improve. With each new mission, we take one step closer to understanding the universe in greater detail. The prospect of discovering new planets, new life forms, or even new civilizations is a powerful motivator for continued exploration. The journey to Alpha Centauri may take decades, and we may face many challenges along the way, but the potential rewards make it a challenge worth pursuing. As we develop new ways to explore the cosmos, who knows what we might find? One thing is certain. The future of space exploration is as exciting as it has ever been. Could this distant, starkly contrasting world harbor life? Like, subscribe, and stay tuned as we delve deeper into the enigma of Proxima b and its potential for life beyond Earth.